Hi, welcome back to AQA Certificate Further Mathematics GCSE. Today we're on Chapter 4.4, Solving Inequalities. This is a great A video. I hope you enjoy it, and let us start. So, equations can always uh, equation can be not equal sometimes, and we have special signs for that, which is the arrow sign. And it is basically the same way you solve uh, normal equations, but when you're doing multiplications, some kind of a trap can come up, and yeah, you have to beware. So let us talk about the graphical representation of in inequalities. So for an inequality symbol, it's going to be directional whether if it's larger than something or smaller than something larger than and equal to or smaller than and equal to and that uh, that are four um, different inequality symbols that you have to know and for graph this is where point zero is and if this circle is not filled it is the normal larger than or e uh, larger than or smaller than symbol the bottom one which has this filled in will be larger than n equal to or smaller than n equal to and whether if it's larger or smaller depends on the arrow direction for example if it's facing the positive x value it is larger than if it's facing opposite the x axis then it's smaller than. So um, uh, these two graph or graphical representations are these two values, which is x larger than zero and x larger than or small or equal to zero. And if it's smaller than, then it goes the other way. Obviously, for quadratic, um, the circle goes where it touches the x-axis and remember it's always a parabola so if you are not sure if it is a larger than or a smaller than draw a graph and see if it is uh, if it should be larger than or smaller than for larger than it's on top of the graph so if there are lines on top of it then those two lines will be the answer to that and if there it is a smaller than sign, then the thing that is under the x-axis will be what you wanted. So that will be a kind of a domain kind of answer. All right. So now let us do some trial of a classical answer. So for a question like this, what you do is just treat the uh, inequality symbol as just addition and like normal equal sign so you rearrange it to get that 5 minus 2 is um, larger than x and so you get that 3 is larger than x or the other way around is x is smaller than 3 so yeah basically that is all these two are equal and everything is true right here but there's one thing that I wanted you to know about which is questions like this what is x? well if you're doing it the normal way then x will be larger than negative 2 right? no do you know why? the reason is in order to turn x into a positive number, you have to divide it by negative 1. Whenever you divide something by negative number on an inequality uh, question, you must flip the symbol. Left and right must be flipped over. It's the symbol, not the side. So um, this is the wrong one throw it away this is the correct one so yeah 
basically. Remember to flip it over so that you don't get it wrong. So, uh, yes, the basic of inequalities are just the same as normal equation, but uh, when you're doing multipl multiplication or division of negative number, then you must flip the sign and just normal addition and subtraction square and root have no effect. Alright, I have made four inequalities that I want you to solve and yeah, you have some time to pause the video and try that yourself and I will show you the answer in just a second. Here we are. Uh, these are the answer to the questions that I've given. This is uh, under the quadratic graph kind of uh, answer, so this is a continuous domain answer. This one is above a quadratic, which are two different parts. So when x is smaller than a negative number, when x is larger than a positive number, so there is a gap in between that is not true but everything outside it is right so yeah if you're confused by these two questions then draw a graph draw a parabola and you will see what is going on so yeah that's it for uh, this video i hope you enjoyed and if you did leave a like Give me some comments and I will see you next time.